I just don't think so. But maybe you're wrong, Teddy. No, I really don't think I'm wrong. Yeah, I know you're usually never wrong, Teddy, but this time you are. Grubby, why are we arguing like this? Huh? Well, because you said you didn't agree with me. And I said that I, um, I said that, hmm, I don't remember. Well, I think that we've been friends for too long to be arguing. Yep, especially if I can't remember what we're arguing about. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Teddy, do you remember when we first met? I sure do, Grubby. That seems like a long time ago. Yes, it does. And there were two sides to that story, too. Uh-huh. Hey, Teddy, why don't you tell your side of that story, and I'll tell mine. Okay. Well, it was in the land of Bologna, where Grubby and I are from. Yeah, and it started before Teddy knew me, and I knew him. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a story about how we met him. <laughs> My family lived in a little cottage. Near our cottage, we had a garden where we grew vegetables. Yeah. Each year, it was my job to help plant the new vegetables. That year, I had to plant potatoes. My mother showed me how to do it. Now, Teddy, there are six rows where you can plant the potatoes. If you do one row each day, you can be finished in less than a week. All right, Mother. You just dig a hole this deep and put a potato in it. Then cover it over with dirt. Oh. That's easy, Mom. I can do that. Well, I worked most of the afternoon, and I finally got the first row planted. Mother, I finished the first row of potatoes. Oh, that's very good, Teddy. Thank you. You're welcome. Now get cleaned up for dinner. Okay. The next morning, I went outside to start planting the second row of potatoes. But during the night, Something had dug up all the potatoes I had planted the day before. Mother! Mother! Teddy, what's wrong? Look, the potatoes I planted yesterday are all gone. There's nothing left but empty holes. Well, that's strange. I wonder what could have caused that. What should I do? I guess you should plant new potatoes in those holes. Okay, Mom. I filled up all the holes with new potatoes. Then I planted the second row, too. Teddy, can I tell my side of the story now? Sure, Grubby. Good. It was later that day, or actually that night. You see, octopedes are sometimes not, uh, not, not, uh... Nocturnal. Yeah, that's it. That means that sometimes we sleep during the day and are awake at night. <coughs> While I was up that night, seeing if I could find any more of those wonderful little roots that I had dug up the night before. You mean potatoes. Yeah, but don't interrupt, Teddy. Dum -de -dum -de -dum. Let's see. I think it was right around here where I found those roots last night. <laughs> oh, boy. I think I found one. Dig, 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 dig. Yep. A nice little round root. And I'll bet there's another one right over here. Dig, 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 dig. Yep. <laughs> dig, 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 dig. Gee, nice of these roots to grow in a nice straight roll like this. Yes, it sure was. And hey, tonight there is a second row right next to the first one. Boy, am I glad I brought along a big bag tonight. Well, the next morning when I got up, I was really surprised to find both rows of potatoes were gone. Oh, I'm sorry, Teddy. I wish I knew what was doing this. So do I, Mother. That day, I spent as much time as I could putting new potatoes back in the holes. Then my mother helped me fix up a special surprise for the potato thief. P potato thief? You mean round root gatherer? Well, whatever. That night, I was almost certain that a third row of roots would have grown next to the other two. And sure enough, it took me most of the night to dig up those round roots. Then suddenly... <coughs> Oh, something fell on me, and there was a lot of noise. Mother, I think we caught the potato thief. It was a net. A net had fallen out of a tree and landed on me. I couldn't move. We went running out to the garden. Our surprise trap had worked. The net had fallen out of the tree and caught something. Yeah. The bells that we had put in the tree were all ringing like an alarm. Look, Mother, look. Teddy, be careful. 
We don't know what that thing is. I was stuck in that net and couldn't move. What do you think it is? Oh, I don't know, Teddy. The two of them kept staring at me. Maybe, maybe it's a big potato bug. Potato bug? I know potato bug. Well, then what are you? I'm just me. I'm an octopede. Well, why are you digging up our potatoes? I'm only digging up these round roots. Round roots? <laughs> Those are potatoes. Teddy, I think we should help him out of that net. All right. What is your name? Oh, I'm Grubby. I didn't know I was taking something that belonged to someone. Oh, that's all right. Yeah. <laughs> my name is Teddy Ruxpin, and this is my mom. How do you do? Um, if you really want those things to be buried, I'll help you put them back in the ground. We explained to Grubby how potatoes grow. Yeah, that's interesting. It was starting to get light, and my mother offered to fix breakfast. Would you like to have breakfast with us, Grubby? Oh, uh, hmm, uh, me, uh, breakfast, uh, um, sure, what are you having? Well, how about potato pancakes? <laughs> <laughs> After breakfast, Grubby got me plant the potatoes. Dig, 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 drop one in, cover it up. Dig, 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 drop one in, cover it up. Hey, this is almost as much fun as digging them up. I really appreciate you helping me, Grubby. Aw, uh, I'm happy to help you, Teddy. After all, I did dig them up. Um, are you sure these potatoes are gonna grow? Oh, sure. Before long, there'll be potatoes all over the place. Oh, good. And are you gonna bury other kinds of food, too? <laughs> yes, we'll plant lots of different kinds of vegetables. Corn and cabbage and tomatoes. And most of them will be just little seeds when we plant them. Wow! Will I be able to help? Of course, Grubby, if you'd like to. Just dig a hole and plant the seed and cover it with soil. Okay. It's fun to see what happens from just a little time. Mm -hmm. The seeds sprout up together from each and every row. When vegetables are growing, it's fun to watch them grow. And the top the potatoes and other vegetables sprout up out of the ground and grow. Yep, they really did grow. <laughs> yes, they did. So that was how Grubby and I met, and our friendship has been growing ever since. Yeah, just like those potatoes. <laughs> and I hope that you'll find lots of friends as you're growing up, because there's nothing in the world like a good friend. You can say that again. Okay, there's nothing in the world like a good friend. <laughs> oh, Teddy Ruxpin is my friend And Grubby's my friend too Bless me, we like to pal around Together we find lots of things to do Oh, Teddy Ruxpin is my friend And Grubby's my friend too Everywhere I count on you I do the same thing too We have a 
Oh, wow.